Thank you very much for tuning in to my YouTube channel. My name is Kenny. Some of you may know me as Kenny Cat. I am a competitive golfer, and this channel is dedicated to my journey on what it takes to become a better competitive golfer. Today's video, I'm going to be running around Las Palomas Golf Sand Links Golf Course. Out here in Mexico, it's a Jack Nicklaus design course. I'm super excited for it. Let's go through a couple of holes. Let's do some footage and talk a little bit about what I'm going to be practicing and focusing on in Season 2. Let's do it right now. hybrid off the tee and then we'll just kind of see what that gets us. All right, first tee shot of the day. No warming up. Vacation style. Let's get after it. but I'll work with it. Yeah, so that first shot hooked really far left. And that's kind of something that I've been working with in my game, especially with that new, like, really deep hip rotation. I'm starting to notice that a lot of shots are pulling left. So it's kind of nice to get out on the course for the first time and see some ball flying. So overall, I think working with new swing changes is definitely interesting to say the least. So it is what it is. We got 170, wind's a little bit off the right. I haven't warmed up, so I'm gonna hit a seven. Just a nice smooth seven. Plus it's sitting up a little high in the grass. And we got some dogs. Seven into the front edge of the green with the two hybrid, 230 with the win. I'm gonna wait till those guys clear and then I'm gonna go ahead and hit three to leave. Shooting right up that hill.
How was that shot? It looked really good. It's like front edge of the green, front right of the green. So we'll see when we get up there. Cool. Let's see if we can get this one close. Kobe. Well, we got about 144 yards. The wind's really strong off the right. So I'm gonna hit a, I wanna hit a nine, but I'm gonna hit an eight, just because I think that the wind's gonna hold it up a little bit too much. All right. bounds left like I said before some of the stuff I'm working with is causing the shots to draw over my driver has traditionally faded so it's just it's a good shot it's just if you're gonna aim for a fade you definitely can't hit a draw pitching wedge all day, but I mean that wind is powerful. It's a solid pitching wedge. I kind of want to hit a nine, but I think a nine is just way too much for it. Yeah, nine's too much. Alright. I'm feeling good about this shot. Set it back in my stance just a little bit.
all in all, I'm excited to see a little bit more of the shot shape. Again, it started to trend more towards uh, overdraw uh, because the bad miss that I had last was a huge push cut. So if the face is getting more closed, that's a good thing. We can always work on better ways to kind of minimize that miss and stop that ball from turning over to the left side. I can't manage the driver today. I don't feel like losing any more balls since I've only got three left. But... I said it would be the last hole, but I lied. This is obviously the last hole. It's the ninth hole. Uh, nice little part five on and two for some really sketch areas. Got about 25 feet left of the All in all, I got a lot to work on in the game. Super excited to see some of the stuff start to come together. A couple of shots are really starting to look good. Some of the things are starting to need a lot more work, but all in all, I'm super impressed with what I've been able to do thus far. As always, thank you very much for watching my YouTube channel. Deuces, people. Let's keep it.